Today we have some exciting news from the Seven Little Johnstons family that you won't want to miss. In the latest episode of Seven Little Johnstons, our favorite couple Liz and Bryce found out some important news about their daughter. Fans have been waiting for months to find out if Liz's daughter will be a little person like her mom. And here's the sensation. In the episode that aired on Tuesday, May 28th, Liz and Bryce went to the doctor for an ultrasound. Can you imagine their excitement? According to the doctor, their daughter is the size of an average baby. That's right, friends, Liz and Bryce's baby girl will be of average height. But before you get too excited, Bryce has an interesting thought. He thinks that their baby girl might still have some of Liz's features. She could be average height, but have some of your features, he told Liz. Bryce couldn't contain his excitement, adding, I'm really happy that everything looks good. She's very healthy and doing great. But let's rewind a bit. Earlier in the episode, Liz's mom, Amber Johnston, shared her thoughts on having a medium-sized baby in the family. This is a new experience for her, as she has never given birth to an average baby before. I have to cheer for our team. Amber joked, expressing her hope that her first grandchild will be a little person. There is strength in little people, she added with a smile. However, Amber was realistic, admitting, I'm quite happy with the average size, but can I be realistic? I've never had a medium-sized baby. It's always nice to hear such honesty, isn't it? And let's not forget about Amber's husband, Trent Johnston, who spoke about the potential challenges of having an average-sized baby in the family. He called it a complete game-changer. Trent had a humorous but practical point when he said, two-year-olds shouldn't be reaching for things that are taller than us. The couple were busy preparing Liz's nursery when they shared these thoughts, giving us a glimpse into their excitement and concern. And here's where it gets even more interesting. While the show has just covered the news of Liz's pregnancy, fans who have been following the family in real time know that Liz and Bryce have already welcomed their baby girl. Leighton Drew, into the world in November 2023. Yes, you heard that right. Baby Leighton is here and she is as adorable as you can imagine. So, let's take a moment to appreciate the journey that Liz and Bryce have been on. For those of you who don't know, Liz Johnston has always been a favorite member of the Seven Little Johnstons family. Her bright personality and strong spirit endeared her to fans around the world. And Bryce, with his unwavering support and love, made their story even more touching. As many of you know, the Johnstons have always been open about their lives, sharing both their ups and downs. This transparency has created a deep connection with their fans. Liz's journey to motherhood is another chapter in their story, filled with hope, love, and anticipation. Amber Johnston's reaction to the news is something that many of you have been wondering about. As a mother of five, the possibility of having an average-sized grandchild is both intriguing and a little nerve-wracking for her. I have to cheer for our team, she chokes, adding a little humor to the situation. Amber's lighthearted approach to life's challenges is one of the many reasons why she is adored by her fans. But Amber isn't the only one with opinions on the matter. Trent Johnston, her husband, has his own point of view. He is practical and realistic, recognizing that a medium-sized baby will bring a new dynamic to their family. Two-year-olds shouldn't be reaching for shit that's taller than us, he jokes. This statement, while amusing, also highlights the Johnston's very tangible reasoning. It's fascinating to watch the family prepare for the birth of Liz's baby. The nursery, the baby clothes, and the anticipation all make for fascinating television. The seven little Johnstons have always shown that family is about love, support, and overcoming life's difficulties together. Liz and Bryce's journey to parenthood is a perfect continuation of this theme. Speaking about Bryce, you can see his excitement about the baby. I'm really happy that everything looks good. She's very healthy and doing great, he says. Bryce's optimism and positivity are infectious, and it's clear that he's ready to welcome fatherhood with open arms. 
For those who have been following Liz and Bryce's relationship, this news seems like a natural progression. From their first dates to living together to now preparing for the birth of their first child, their story is one of growing and deepening love. Fans have watched their bond grow stronger and the arrival of baby Layton is a testament to their journey together. As we celebrate the arrival of baby Layton, it's also important to note the support system that Liz and Bryce have in place. The Johnston family, with its unique dynamics and unbreakable bond, will undoubtedly play a significant role in Layton's life. Amber, Trent, and the rest of the Johnston clan are ready to welcome this new addition with open arms and hearts. Let's take a look at how the news has affected the fans. The outpouring of love and congratulations to Liz and Bryce has been overwhelming. Social media has been flooded with messages of support and admiration. Fans shared their own experiences and gave advice, creating a wonderful community of support around the new parents. Looking ahead, it will be interesting to see how Liz and Bryce cope with parenthood. The challenges, joys, and surprises that come with raising a child are sure to make for some exciting episodes. And with the Johnston family's trademark humor and warmth, we're sure to have fun. In conclusion, the news of Liz and Bryce's baby girl, Leighton Drew, was an important milestone for seven little Johnstons. It's a story about love, family, and the exciting unknowns of parenthood. As we watch Liz and Bryce embark on this new journey, we can't help but feel like a part of their extended family. Thank you so much for joining us today. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring the notification bell so you don't miss a new video. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below. That's Julie, I'm wrapping up. Until next time, keep on loving, keep on supporting, and stay tuned for more news from the world of stars and TV shows. Bye!